Trinity College Kandy is a leading independent private boys' school in Sri Lanka offering primary and secondary education. The college is proud of its educational heritage that British rulers together with Anglican Church established in colonial Sri Lanka as far back as 1872. It is located in the center of the beautiful mountainous city of Kandy, 550 meters above sea level. The school is well equipped with all modern and state-of-the-art teaching amenities and facilities for sports and other non-academic activities to pass out annual enrollment of 3,500 students. Trinity College is proud of its products who has shined in every field they have engaged. From top-class diplomats who have won the recognition of United Nations to powerful cabinet portfolios in almost all ruling governments, best national cricket captain Sri Lanka has ever produced. Leaders who commanded the decades ran civil war and heroes who never feared to sacrifice their lives for the betterment of others. And sportsmen of every discipline who brought recognition to Sri Lanka. The Old Boys Association of Trinity College is a very active group which span all over the world. They carry out various development projects to the school such as construction of new buildings, donate transport vehicles, scholarships, and donate cash for the college fund and various other development activities. Hundred and seventy-five classmates who passed out from Trinity College in the year 1992 however thought differently. They wanted to do something special for their school coinciding with the 25th anniversary year since they left school. They wanted to do something which has a high impact, sustainable, environmental friendly and with faster implementation time. The class of 92 plan to execute a solar power generating system in the roofs of Trinity College. The concept evolved along with the aggressive campaign launched by the Sri Lanka government to install solar rooftop systems in one million households. It was planned that the energy produced by the solar system will be first consumed by the college and the balance will be exported to the national grid which attracts additional cash flows to the college. It was also decided to raise the majority of the funds within the batch. A well-organized social media campaign was launched by the passed-out batchmates of Class 92 with the aim of collecting the required funds for the project. A separate committee was appointed by the Class of 92 towards smooth progression of the project. The donations came from four corners of the world. Under the leadership of the president of the batch and the chairman of the project committee, the classmates responded very positively and with great generosity. The required funds for 65% of the investment was collected within three months. The project was co-funded by Commercial Bank PLC for the balance 35%. After a very transparent and competitive bidding process, the responsibility of carrying out the project in turnkey basis was entrusted to the company First Energy. The agreement for the turnkey construction was signed on May 20, 2017 at the Historical Chapel of Trinity College. It was a worthy occasion for the passed out classmates of 92 to reunite and recall the wonderful memories of their childhood at the school. The project kickoff was held ceremoniously with the principal being the chief guest. Initial studies revealed that the school consumes approximately 190,000 units of electricity per year. After studying the solar potential and local irradiation levels, it was decided that a solar system could be implemented to supply 75% of the demand. Thus, a capacity of 100 kilowatt peak was derived as the project capacity. 
after careful analysis by structural engineers of the company First Energy. It was decided to mount 50% of the solar modules in the primary school Montessori roof and balance 50% in the middle school roof. The project team of company First Energy mobilized at the site on May 5, 2017. The selected solar modules are EC 280 Watt Peak from Singapore and SMA inverters from Germany arrived at site ahead of schedule. As the normal school activities were ongoing during the installation, special safety measures were taken to ensure safety of the school children. It was observed that there could be a threat from monkeys who roamed around the roofs of the college as it borders a forest reserve. Therefore, it was decided that all electric wires to be sent through steel conducts for extra safety. The project completed on time to celebrate the 25th anniversary of the passed out students of class of 1992. The commencement of commercial operation of the project was launched simultaneously to the event organized by the batch on August 11, 2017. The class of 92 did not forget the teachers who taught them 25 years ago on this day. Most of the living teachers were invited for this memorable and important event. Special gifts were also handed over. It was a joyous moment for everyone involved, a project completed within the budget and on time, sustainable and environmental friendly. The generation of 140,000 units of electricity per year powered by the sun with no carbon footprint shows the commitment and modern thinking of the classmates of 92 batch towards the environment. The event was celebrated by a dinner dance organized by the batch where majority of batch mates and their spouses participated. It was an unforgettable evening for everyone. The solar rooftop system is in operation since August 2017. The actual energy production is on par with the predicted values. The class of 92 proved that they think differently. The project had a high impact. The commercial viability of the project and financial benefit to the school were evident from the very first year of operation. Highly reliable products used by the company First Energy increased the performance and level of efficiency. The concept of sustainability and eliminating carbon footprint by generating green energy helps all of us save our world for the next generation. Trinity College Candy has demonstrated this idea successfully through the old boys of class of 92.